Radio Plus. Keeping our local communities informed during the current coronavirus wants to know, how has the virus affected your operation? From major employers to religious groups, car dealers to banks, restaurants to nonprofits. Our goal is to provide mass communication that's timely, responsible, and above all, truthful. And now, here's more from the Murray Furniture Newsroom. Good morning. As we continue to monitor the coronavirus and COVID-19 and the ever-changing situation. Joining us now from Holiday Automotive is our good friend from the radio station, Mike Shannon. Mike, thanks for being here. How are you this morning? Uh, you're welcome. I'm, I'm good. I'm, I'm doing good. How are you? Doing just fine here. Very well, Mike. Good. So, Mike, right off the bat, how has Holiday Automotive seen this coronavirus? And what are you guys doing um, with reaction to what's going on? And how are you prepping? Well, it's uh, it's been a, a, a little bit of a, a, a challenge just getting uh, our plan together. But I think we've got that all finalized last week. And uh, uh, we're, uh, we're, we're doing pretty good. We uh, are working with our uh, partners at Service Master who clean our buildings and uh, nightly our phones are being sanitized, our doorknobs and door handles inside and out are being sanitized. Uh, we're sanitizing all our uh, touch points in the dealership uh, and we're sanitizing cars. We have a procedure that actually uh, was shared with us from Ford Motor Company uh, for sa- uh, sanitizing the inside of the vehicles and uh, we're doing that on every vehicle that comes in for service. And it's in a, uh, it's a, uh, we, we, again, we hit all the touch points in the car. And then we're uh, using steering wheel wraps on the steering wheels. We're sanitizing steering wheels before they go out on test drives and uh, that type of thing. So we're doing all those things, which many businesses are doing as well. I think everybody uh, uh, is doing their very best to try and keep things as clean as possible just because of the spread of germs. But uh, other than that, we, uh, we've got some uh, changes to the way we operate. Uh, we are, uh, as of yesterday, we're picking up and delivering service customers' cars. Uh, if somebody feels they don't want to come in and have their uh, vehicle serviced, uh, we will pick that vehicle up at their house or their office. Uh, again, we'll sanitize it, service it, uh, uh, clean it, and bring it back to them. Uh, just uh, for people that have, may have some anxiety about uh, 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 venturing out. Uh, so that, uh, that I think, uh, uh, will uh, uh, help our customers uh, for sure. Uh, our manufacturing partners are also rallying around this, and uh, we had some great news yesterday afternoon from General Motors. Uh, Chevrolet, Buick, and GMC are uh, coming out with a program where they're going to uh, reactivate OnStar on people's cars who have let their subscription uh, lapse. Mm-hmm. Uh, on, OnStar is a s- subscription service, but all the safety features that go with OnStar are being uh, uh, reinstated into everybody's vehicle at no charge, and they're going to do that for the next uh, 90 days. Mm-hmm. They also mm-hmm. are adding 3G uh, uh, to the vehicles. Uh, that's a subscription service as well. And uh, some people elect not to not to uh, go with that service. Everybody's getting that. 16 million uh, cars and trucks uh, will have the uh, 3G, uh, 3G uh, added for the next 90 days. And, and the reason for that is people working from home, maybe working more from their car, <clears throat> maybe their uh, Wi-Fi is uh, uh, weaker at home. They'll be able to go right out in their car and do it. So those are just some safety things that uh, General Motors. Uh, added and that'll take effect as of today uh also we have major incentive announcements and i think uh you're going to see most of the manufacturers do something like this but uh right now uh as of yesterday afternoon you could uh finance a uh, chevrolet buick or gmc uh, most of our most popular models uh for a uh, interest rate of zero zero percent and it'll they'll take that all the way to 84 months uh, which uh, is a long time, but uh, it really makes a, a wow. uh, wow, that's lessens cool. the payment. So zero for 84 four months was announced yesterday on most of our, our, our popular models with those brands. Also, a 124, I'm sorry, 120-day deferral 
So payments will be deferred. Uh, your first payment wouldn't be due for the next 120 days. And the, wow, the reason amazing. there is it would get us through, hopefully get us through uh, this situation and uh, people uh, uh, won't have a payment due for 120 days. So I think you're going to see more of that coming from other manufacturers as well. Uh, you know, the, the auto industry has, got, has had a history of stepping up uh, in tough times. <clears throat> I remember 9-11, uh, you know, it, uh, it turned, the, turned the economy around when the auto industry uh, came out with their incentive programs. And uh, hopefully the, these large car companies are going to do the same thing this time. But uh, it's certainly different. I mean, it, people have anxiety and people, and rightly so, uh, you know, this is a, this is a tough deal. And, uh, you know, hopefully uh, we get some more sunshine and Fond du Lac and warm weather in this uh, flu season usually starts to uh, lessen. So hopefully that'll be the case. We're talking but, with uh, uh, for Mike. Cert- for certain, we don't want to, uh, create a lot of hysteria and that type of thing. I mean, it's uh, people have to stay calm. We'll get through this. Uh, Americans always find a way to do it. And uh, but uh, I, I also look at uh, interest rates in general. Uh, you know, interest rates are home mortgages are going to be at a historical low, and uh, people will be refinancing their homes, and I think that will will help them financially uh, for sure. And uh, fuel prices. Uh, which is another major expense for, for many people. Fuel prices are, are going down, and uh, uh, obviously the stock market has gone down as well. Mm-hmm. Uh, I do think you'll see that bounce back. Uh, it's going to take a little time, but I do think you'll see that bounce back. But uh, So, so far, we're, we're surviving pretty well. Our, our team has been awesome. Uh, they've, uh, everybody's rallied around us, and uh, we're going to be there for our customers. We're going to be there to support them. Uh, we're going to be there to continue to support the community uh, the very best we can. Talking with Mike Shannon from Holiday Automotive here this morning. Mike, is Holiday open normal hours, or have you adjusted that based on what's happening? No, we're, we're open normal hours. Uh, you know, we still have lots of cars and trucks to service, uh, so we're open, uh, we're open our normal hours. And we don't have any plans of changing that, at least at this point. But, uh, you know, this is, a, this is a very fluid thing. You know, things are changing rapidly. But at this point, uh, we're open and we're doing business. We, uh, uh, you know, we, uh, we monitor this on a daily basis. And, you know, we serviced over 200 cars yesterday uh, in our stores. And, uh, we, you know, we're selling cars. We're, you know, the, the, uh, the pace is off a little bit, but not, not dramatically, not as much as you'd guess. Uh, and uh, I think these new incentive programs will help. But uh, you know, we're 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 staying the course, and uh, obviously we're in, we're telling our team members if they feel sick and they they they've got a cold or a, a virus, we want them to stay home. I mean, uh, that that goes without without saying. And uh, we're doing everything we possibly can to sanitize our building, our facilities, and uh, uh, customers' cars. So. Uh, at this point, uh, our team has done a really good job, and we've had a lot of input from our team members. And uh, we're, we're, we're fortunate to, to have the type of people in Fond du Lac that we do that make a, a real uh, uh, dedicated group. Mike, we appreciate your time. Thank you so much here this morning, and best of luck to you in this tough time. Thank you. You bet. All right. Take Bye-bye. care. Yep. That's Mike Shannon from Holiday Automotive.